children today we are going to start chapter 16 data handling in maths first of all let us understand what data means data is collection of information and facts okay then pictograph these are some new terms which you will come across in the chapter pictograph the representation of given data by pictures is called a pictograph students let us understand pictograph that is a representation of a given data by pictures with an example here sneha went to a toy shop she found that the following toys were sold in a day cars 8 dolls 4 robots 2 trucks 3 now we have to represent this data by a pictograph so how are we going to do it toys sold in a day we can make columns to represent the items that is cars doll robot truck and we can choose one symbol or a picture here one star has been chosen so the key is also given that one star represents one toy so how many cars were sold eight so we have drawn eight stars to represent eight cars dolls four so we have drawn four stars robots two so two stars are here and trucks three so three stars have been made so by looking at this pictograph we can easily understand how the data has been represented here with the help of this symbol star now let us understand bar graphs bar graph is the representation of the given data by bars children we need to remember certain points about the bar graph bars may be vertical that is top to bottom or horizontal left to right bars are of uniform width throughout the gap between two bars is uniform throughout bar graph has a title children you can easily understand a bar graph by looking at this example as mentioned bar graph can be vertical that is from top to bottom or from bottom to top starting from zero or horizontal okay from left to right both these bar graph represent the same data but one that is in green color represents a vertical bar graph the one in pink represents a horizontal bar graph they have a title what is the title marks obtained by atul we have a title here also then bar graph have uniform width throughout that is the width of the bar graph starting from the top that is from the bottom to the top is the same uniform means the width or the thickness of the bar graph is the same bar ki chaudai shuru se lekar ant tak same rehti hai it is applied for both the vertical and the horizontal bar graphs second point is the spacing between the two bars is also same throughout you can see that the spacing for both the vertical and the horizontal bar graph is the same this is the proper way to represent data in the form of bar graph